Hey YouTubers, thanks for viewing my channel and this is my very first video ever and in this video I'm going to showcase my military truck, the Dragon Wagon. It's a Franken truck made from two different military vehicles and a camper. The vehicle it's based on is a 5 ton M932A2. This was originally a tractor truck and the A2 revision has the Cummins 8.3 liter engine which is very reliable and fuel efficient. It's also backed by an Allison transmission well known for the reliability. The version of this truck, the tractor truck, is the shortest wheelbase of all five tons, so that's important. So you have a tight turning radius for off-road and parking lot situations, things like that. It's only two and a half feet longer than a regular Ford excursion wheelbase. The truck pictured here is the actual truck that was used in the build. Now the cab for this vehicle comes off of an MK48 LVS. This was originally a marine equivalent of a Hemet. It was articulated in the center, had two steering axles, and at the time this vehicle was built, people, regular public people, could not buy this vehicle from auction. The website Government Liquidation did not sell them to the public yet in 2016, so a lot of people online were making customized versions using surplus cabs. And that's how I picked this thing up. I actually found it online as a semi-complete project and I finished up the cab conversion. All in all, I paid about $11,000 for the truck as it sits. So I wanted to build like a house that no one else had, a vehicle on wheels I could go anywhere at any time for a good deal and some of that would be reliable so I needed to find like a camper and I only had a couple months to do it because the company I was working for at the time, Local Motors was kind of going through some stuff and I, I knew I had to actually like move to be successful but being a millennial in 2016 housing prices were still crazy back then and I didn't want to like buy a house and have a bunch of money tied into something like that so I decided a cheap fifth wheel camper something with a low ceiling height that I could buy on Craigslist would be the best option I found this 1987 Fleetwood Prowler now what I did was I created a three point pivoting subframe so the actual camper won't rip itself apart and then I mounted this camper on the back of the truck after the camper was mounted I did some flex tests to make sure that the tires wouldn't contact any area of the camper I water jet some plate and extended the frame and built another pivot for the bumper and spare tire carrier. And then I tested it. I put around 1,000 miles on it, taking on some off-road trails, taking around some highway, and uh, made sure the vehicle is reliable for its journey. The last thing to do is put some fresh tires on because the tires that were on it were around 10 years old. So I got them for around 100 bucks a piece. I drove to Texas to get them. I painted the vehicle and I quit my job. That would be the start of the Dragon Wagon journey, which is about seven years in the making. So that's it for this video. I want to do some more videos showcasing my journey. Uh, the interior, people really want to see the interior. Uh, the solar system and some other projects I'm working on. So be sure to smash that subscribe button and uh, like this video and stay tuned.